so today we're making a double chocolate raspberry muffin. It was requested by the family, so I had to do it. Two cups of flour go straight in. We're gonna try to make everything in only one pot. Put just the dry ingredients first, and then we'll make a well and put the wet ingredients then. We have one cup of sugar right here, a half a cup of good cocoa powder, unsweetened, one teaspoon of baking soda and a half a teaspoon of salt. So mix those dry ingredients very well. And as you go now, try to make a well in the middle so that we bring all our wet ingredients. One cup of plain yogurt. I use European plain yogurt. I like the flavor of it. Add a fresh egg and half a cup of milk. This is almond milk, but you can use any milk you like. A half a cup of oil. This is canola oil. I wouldn't use olive oil, but you can if you have to. One teaspoon of vanilla extract and start mixing, staying in the middle. Combine all those wet ingredients without going over into the dry ingredient quite yet and when the wet ingredients are well incorporated start going with the dry ingredients but not too early now we're bringing the wet ingredients to the dry ingredients but you don't need to overwork this just to mix it up a little bit. It's okay if you still have some dry flour in it. This is where double chocolate comes in. We're bringing a half a cup of chocolate chip and a whole cup of frozen raspberry. It's important to keep it frozen so that they keep their consistency and then they don't get too smashed in there. Fill in your tins with your little muffin papers and fill it all in. Work it with a chopstick to make it nice and even. Then into a hot oven at 400 degrees for about 20 to 22 minutes. This was really easy. The kids are gonna love it. And actually not just the kids, but everybody's gonna love it. You can keep those for three days in the refrigerator or three months in the freezer. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you and see you next time.